a lot of people are trying to put Team Maro down. Yes. A lot of people are in the village, mostly, are trying to put our names down. Yeah. They are trying to bring us down, yeah. but we cannot go down. Yeah. You see, they are trying to put our names to be people bad, bad people, bad people, but you are not bad people. Yeah. Yeah. If they try to put our names down, we'll still go up. Yeah. So guys, keep praying for us. Stop it. Get some help. I am okay. I can do the video and it will to tell you what is going on from our, from our myself. Yes. All right, guys. So, <sighs> guys, guys, I don't know what can you talk, but God, you know, God, you know. All right, guys. Remember, I told you. Uh, it's not good to talk uh, more more things about my case. So about the case. So thank you and I appreciate wherever you are. God bless you. What? What the fuck? Did you did you meet any nice girls over there? Mm. Congress, why are you listening? Why are you listening? Why are you listening? <laughs> There's a family that talks bad things about me. People, do you think that I can continue helping their child? Or don't, man, don't, don't, bro. Allah, don't. But when one forces anyone to help, no. You tend to listen to more lies than the truth. I couldn't believe what you said on camera, calling us poor. I'm not poor, man. I'm not poor, Maro. I'm not poor. I'm not poor. You're the one who champion like so much division, so you should stop that. But you're the one who is championing it. You're championing for the division of the village. You're the one pushing for that. My children been attacked. If you really wanted to talk direct to me, man, put that camera down. Come talk to me. Come talk to me. Put your camera down. Come talk to me, man. The pressure is getting. Hey guys, welcome back and welcome if this is uh, your first time joining us. Thank you so much. I really appreciate your presence. Of course, if this is your first time watching or you've been watching but you've not subscribed, kindly consider subscribing, share your thoughts in the comment section and smash the like button. But of course, you can consider turning the notification bell on. You can as well share the video, but of course, I really want to appreciate all of you who have uh, turned on the notification bell. Because I was just checking the analytics and I was like, wow, thank you so, so much. So, before we get into uh, today's video, I'd like to thank all of you for tuning in because uh, it takes your time. I know you're entertained, you get updated, if these are the people you follow, you know. But uh, thank you so much for your time because you chose to watch this one. Thank you so much. And of course, for my people, thank you so much for always coming back. You watch, you like, you share, you comment. Thank you so much. Some of you are uh, my moderators. Thank you so much. So, let's get to today's video because hey, hey, the the scammers are in one pot. A kind of scammers in one hey, one space because I just saw um, why not Kibe? <laughs> I saw Gitriba, of course he's back. But uh, there were some interesting things that I noticed and I was like, what? What is happening? So, Let's start, you know, we always start with the small, small ones as we go to the unimaginable. So, let's start with this clip that uh, the Trent Town boy was, uh, was uh, with Why Not Kibe and uh, David Jr. So, let's watch, then we come back. Because that is when I noticed, like, what is he doing? What is happening? And David Jr. is always is proving to be Nivea Jr. Because, let's watch before I even get ahead of myself. Hello, sir. How are you doing? I'm fine, and you? I'm doing fantastic. Yeah, Welcome you? home. Yes, I'm mm -hmm. glad to be home. The, From uh, the US. Yes, the you village. enjoyed your time. I heard that you went to the Philippines. I see that you went to the Philippines. Oh, thank you so much. It was a nice experience in which I can't wait to be back there, you know. It's kind of my second home right. after Kenya. So I'm going to have to teach him how to, how to communicate when he gets there. So when he gets there, now he's going to say to them, Maganda Umaga. And that's going to mean good morning. Maganda apong means good evening. Kamustaga, how are you? 
Mabuti naman, my friend. Mabuti naman. I'm okay, my friend. <laughs> hey, guys, when I was in the Philippines, you remember language barrier? It was something else. I couldn't understand anything. What I know is sam- salamat po, which means thank you. Thank you. And that's all. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Yeah, so you had a good time. You had a great time. Which other country did you stop in, in going to the Philippines? Did okay. you stop in... My first, uh, I was in layover in Ethiopia, okay. then Hong Kong, China, then uh, Manila, Philippines. Oh, you went That's straight to Manila. But it was a long, long journey, but uh, we made it. 24 hours, right? We made it. Close to that. Mm. Mm-hmm. You've been in the Philippines? I've never been to the Philippines. I've mm-hmm. never been to Asia. Mm-hmm. Yeah. How did you meet Tagalog? Associating with people who speak it. Oh, it's being smart. You, um, did, you, did you meet any nice girls over there? Mm. Congress, why are you listening? Why are you Congress. listening? Why are you listening? <laughs> yeah, I met nice people. It's evident on my videos. Yeah. Big shout out to Lizzie and also one of our fans decided like I want to meet her daughter. So yeah, it was a nice experience. They showed me around. <laughs> Within now uh, Philippines, Manila to be precise, and uh, I love the vibe, you know. Yeah. People are so contented with whatever they have, and they're happy. They are living life to the fullest, and I learned that in this life, you just want to appreciate what it is, you mm. know. And um, life, it's a gift, you know. When it's gone, it's gone. Right. So you have to take care of yourself, mm. and uh, health is key, mm. you know. Mm-hmm. So you need to get one of those nice girls from Dr. Kibi. <laughs> Guys, you have Dr. Dr. Kibe here. Please introduce yourself yes, for my audience. People? Yes, my name is Kibe. Mm-hmm. Why not Kibe? Yeah. And I'm here with uh, Mr. Devi. Mm-hmm. I'm uh, their home. Yeah. We have a very good time. They've invited us for breakfast. We've had exactly. an breakfast. Mm-hmm. And we are here with Mr. Cecil. Sure, and guys. Mr. Cecil is saying he wants me to have a Philippine lady. <laughs> but we'll see. In future, you want to travel to Philippines? Are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. I'm uh-huh. ready to experience different cultures uh-huh. in this world. So why not Philippines? Guys, he has a YouTube channel as well. Please check him out. Yes, at... Go check me out at Why Not Kibe, guys. That is it. Thank you so that much. That is it. Yes. Welcome, sir. Right. There are so many things that uh, personally I get from that clip. Honestly, I might be overthinking, but at the same time, I'm like, wow, interesting. Because, guys, I don't know if you remember when... Um, why not Kibe came out here defending himself for the scams, you know, for the drama with the with the partner, with the lady that uh, contributed some amount so that they can own the shop together. So, I don't know if you remember, but there was a point that he was like, oh, you know, I'm not so happy about uh, the lady exposing this on the internet because um, my other friends, my other friends, the people who are helping me, you know, the donations, the donators, will not, uh, might stop, you know, might stop um, trusting me, run away from me because uh, of what is going on. Because, yeah, you were exposed, and that is a fact, because you agreed that the lady sent you some amount. So, for you to, and stop answering the calls from the partner, that was wrong. That was coming because you took the donations and you didn't want to. You didn't want her to be part of it. So let me, that is not what we are talking about. Let me come back to what I thought when I watched that. When I saw Why Not Kibe, because I was like, wow, this is a convicted (laughs) scammer doing what? In a villa, in the villa, in a congressman compound together with a train town boy and a David Jr. was like, what? What? Did I just see him? So this is what I thought. Number one, how? The Trent Town boy is part of this, not part of this in the negative side, is being <laughs> is being exploited by this one. Yes, because of course he came out here and he was like, I don't want my other friends to start doubting me, this and that. And of course, if someone can do what he did, it's so hard to convince someone that uh, is not doing the same to the likes of um, Trent Town boy. Because of course, we know these boys, when they want to exploit you, they d- they'll run towards you, hmm? clinch to you so that they can get the donations from you. The second thing that uh, came through my mind was that, um, did you see how uh, David Jr. was <laughs> responding to what they were trying to tell him? No interest, and I was like, wow, Nivea Jr., that is why. So, let's go back to why not Kibe with the train town boy. Although, of course, we've seen... Uh, that uh, Jamaican uncle is also there, but you can notice that uh, why not Kibe is more close to Trenton boy, and I think he even drove him 
is driving him around and of course not for nothing because we know these people this is something else that i wanted to talk about of course you can already know who is teaching these people to be scammers who is encouraging these people in these scam activities because why is he doing what is he doing in a mura's compound while it has already been known what he did and of course that goes to tell you that uh uh sensor was like don't mind them they'll talk you know they'll come over you're my boy <laughs> because that is what i do that is what i also do but uh, they'll not do anything can you imagine because of course there is no doubt that uh, the same that the same person that gave her uh, why not kibe for the partnership was once sensor's supporter instead of sensor coming out to condemn why not kibe of what he did this is what he's doing a lot of people are trying to put Tim Maro down. Yes. A lot of people are in the village, mostly, and trying to put our names down. Mm. They are trying to bring us down, mm. but we cannot go down. Mm. You see, they are trying to put our names to be people bad, bad people, bad people, but you are not bad people. Mm. So, don't, 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 don't go with them. Mm. If they try to put our names down, we will still go up. Mm. So, uh, you understand. I don't know what they do next. Mm. So, guys, keep praying for us. Keep watching our videos. Subscribe to our videos. You guys know us. You've watched us for a very long time and you know who we are. Yeah. So uh, I'm okay. And yeah. Ziriba, I'm sure all is okay. Mm. All is gonna be alright. Mm. And I'm happy to see you smiling and being very happy. Mm. Yes, that is my great uh, happiness. When thank I see you happy, yes. I'm happy. All right. Yes. yes. Thank you. Thank, thank you so much. Yes. And, uh, we are here. We are here right. together. We are here to earn and everything. Exactly. And I see you came with the amazing something here. Come, I show you. Come, I show you. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Look here. Hey, look at hey, Mr. Gake from inside. Look at the boys. <laughs> look, look at the hand. What do you say? What do you say? Welcoming him. And of course, you can just imagine what they talk behind the scenes. Because for him to be given the consent to come to the villa, of course, they talked. And uh, probably Mura was like, just come over. Don't mind. She's not the only one that can give you the funds to fund your endeavors. Come over. Train town boy is around. You might be lucky. Or rather, maybe is also funding you. So why bother? So this is something that clearly tells you what you might want to know. He is the father of all this coming. And I say, th and I say that because of purely the way he's treating. Why not Kibe? We've not seen him come out here and condemn what he did. Of course, he knows. But instead, he'll come out here, oh, there are some people talking bad about me, but uh, this is what I'll do, I'm just a good person, just donate to me because I'm good. What? So let me know what you think about that, because uh, personally, I was like, I'm not buying this. I'll make the conclusion that he encourages these people, because we've seen it. He's in his compound, he has not come out here to call out what he did. Of course, he has automatically cancelled the person that was scammed by why not Kibe? Can you imagine? The same thing that is out here, doing to other people, doing to the likes of uh, Pablo K.E. He, he came out here. <laughs> he came out here to call out Mura Senso, finally, because, of course, he has been trying. He has been trying to play uh, Nasto's eh, games of, you know, just playing alone playing along with the Amura sensor so that he cannot be cancelled but I applaud him for that so this is what I was saying he is doing this just the same way he handles the likes of Pablo K.E. just because uh, he invited um, Minhawi to the podcast he, he was cancelled but he will not talk about the issues that uh, Minhawi was raising because Minhawi talked about so many things about uh, Lamborghini Mwango ambushing people in the forest in the bushes he will never mention that, but he will just come out here to cancel people. Just the way he's uh, handling why not Kibe's issue. Because this is what he's doing. Oh, I'll not come out here and talk about what transpired. I'll just invite why not Kibe to my compound because we dance to the same tune. We come out here, take money that is not supposed to is not uh, rightfully ours, but uh, people will not do anything. So that is all about Kibe. Of course, let me know what you think about that situation because i'm still <laughs> shocked like what you're openly telling us that you're part of what why not keep did because you're encouraging him huh? you're an enabler if not part of all these things that these scammers are doing out here so 
Let's talk about uh, Gitriba because he came out here finally after being arrested for mole. Mm -hmm. Hey, people's kids, and of course, the same way Mura handles these issues, exactly the same way because this is what he said. Oh, guys, you know, I'm not going to be talking about my case, so, oh, although I understand sometimes you're not supposed to talk on uh, what is going on in court because it's an active case. But at the same time, I'm like, he should have at least highlighted what he was arrested for. Uh, but uh, he didn't do that because I don't know if you understand what I'm trying to say. Because, of course, if he comes out here and he's like, oh, guys, you know, I was accused of doing this to minors. Anyone with a brain will go, you know, do his or her research and find out that he's not a good person. So, learning from, uh, learning from Mura Senso, he will not talk about what he was arrested for. He came out here and this is what he was saying. Oh guys, kindly pray for me because eh, I'll not even say what I was arrested for, but uh, please pray for me because just pray for me. But now, this is something that was so interesting. I was like, I see you. This is what he said. Guys, I'll put my number on the screen. He mentioned, I wanted to compile the number of times that he mentioned about the phone number. But of course, that is a lot of work. But uh, of course, just take it for me. That is what he was saying more than 10 times. And uh, he did edit, he edited out some parts of it because he was like, support me. At some point, I think he said that um, send some money for me, but he edited out that part, but you can easily know. For watching my video, for advising me truth from the video, thank you a lot and God bless you wherever you are, guys. Thank you and I really appreciate all family from YouTube. Thank you and I really appreciate, guys. Yeah, so I want to go to the, our new home to show what is going on there, guys. It was very sick, so at least today, at least today I am okay. I can do the video and it will, to tell you what is going on from our, our myself. Yes. All right, guys. So guys, guys, I don't know what can you talk, but God, you know, God, you know. All right, guys. Remember, I told you. Uh, it's not good to talk uh, more more things about in my case so about the case so thank you and I love appreciate wherever you are God bless you and the God with you in time in time you are in time you're going thank you a lot guys but from myself my 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 heart guys it's open it's open I don't have class with the end people from the village. I don't have clutch with the end people, guys. Who was talking bad things from uh, through me? I don't, I don't, I don't. My my heart is open, guys. I don't have clutch with any people. Yes, guys. Me, I appreciate and I thank God for giving me energy today and to talk today after, after, after coming came from from Romande I was very sick I was sick actually guys but today I am okay all right guys so God with you and God with me guys who any people talking about to me yes guys I don't have clutch with you me my my me my my heart very very open guys very open and I, my heart, I, do, I don't have clutch with any people, guys. Thank you a lot. So let me go to the our new home to update what is going on. So this is what I wanted to say. The same thing. The enabler of all these things. The king of all scammers. You know, you come out here, you've been accused of one, two, two or three things. But this is how you handle it. Come out here. Guys pray for me i have a number send me some donation send me some money so this is where i find a problem with all these things to do with the gitriba the king and these all accomplices this is what i have a problem with you come out here you ask people to send you money and that is what you did because of course when I, they take him the legal way it will take a process and of course i'd have to agree because this is something that have come out here the video before yesterday I was like, someone is 
a suspect until you're proven guilty. But of course we know. We know, but legally has not been convicted, but this is what I have to say. You do all th these things and you come out here and tell people to send you some money. <laughs> and the people that will be sending money to Gitiriba, shame on you because you're also Mole. Mm -hmm. You're also part of that because you're supporting someone who does that. What does that tell you about the same person donating to Gitiriba? The same thing that Mura Senso is doing, yes. Allow me to say this because for you to allow this person to come back to your compound and the case is not even over. And of course you've seen these allegations, you know the people that have uh, the victims, you know whether it's true or not. Most of the times, especially if you come from the same village, you definitely know. We have the likes of our sister to Mogesi. She came out here. She is a victim and she's the first person. It's not a reported speech. That is what she said. But Murat Senso is still accommodating the Tiriba while calling out Pablo. Shame on you, Murat Senso, and it's so shameful for anyone with kids or a parent to be. Because can you imagine the same Gitiriba in the lights? Eh? Why not keep it? They are scamming people. They are out here doing all these things to these young kids. But you just watch. And you have kids. You have siblings. You have young Cousins, you have all these things that you're supposed to be out here condemning. Shame on all of you. Instead, you come out here and call out the likes of Pablo. What has Pablo done? So, because I've just talked about that, let's talk about um, uh, Pablo K.E. But before that, let's talk about uh, Percy because hey, this is what happened. Of course, uh, the train town boy was like, I have a lot of uh, donations. And uh, that is something that Amura had addressed when, uh, in one of these uh, ranting sessions on Sundays. And this is what he said, which was so shocking to me. Oh, guys, I have my visitor has brought a lot, a lot of gifts. I don't know even who we, we, we are going to give. And I'm like, Mura, that is not what you bought. It's up to the visitor to give who he or she wants to give. So this is what he said. I think at this point, we as the family have to take all the gifts for ourselves because some people are not grateful and that goes to tell you that they were these visitors because of course we know why they are still being allowed to come over and uh, the queen parasite was like i don't want these uh, black parasites coming to my villa of course we know why these two black people are still allowed there the train town boy and the uh, jamaican uncle it's purely because of what they bring it's purely because of what they bring. And for that reason, Mura was like, we'll take the gifts because most of the villagers, we don't vibe with them. I believe for that reason, uh, they warned or they or rather gave directions to the train town boy on who to give and, not, and, not, and uh, who not to give. Because guys, this is what happened. From reliable sources, this is what happened. Allegedly, uh, the train town boy gave some gifts to Patsy. And this is what happened. Huh? <laughs> all of the Muras boys, the scammers, the mole, and all these people, they came for Percy. And uh, the train town boy had to intervene. <laughs> Can you imagine all those men? Others accused, others convicted of all these things. They have the audacity to come for a woman that has gotten consent from train town boy to come and pick the gifts. Uh, and uh, according to the same reliable sources, I'm told that um, uh, Train Town Boy had to intervene so that uh, the, these nasty people could not harm its person. And uh, well, do you remember in the villa now what happened there? During now, Percy went to look for uh, uh, the present that uh, or the prizes that came with uh, the, the Cecile. She was uh, being chased with the, 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 the... Not only chased. Yeah. They even they even tied is called what? Mm. <laughs> it's, it's called tying. No, not tying. It yeah. is it is uh, uh, touching in the neck ah. this way. It's called in English. Talking about that. Uh, the, the no, my friend. <laughs> this way, this way in English, I can hit you like a Cherokee uh, drum. It's called. Uh, let me uh, let me think. Harassment. Huh? No, no, no. Not harassment. <coughs> Hang. They, let's, abuse, let's go with they hanging him. Uh -huh. they, 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 they took care of the net. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine, yeah? you know, for, for my thought is that, uh, eh? uh, 
you know, it's not good to do for a woman like that. Not only that. a woman, a widow. A widow. Imagine a widow. Yeah. Hey. And imagine hey. the person who is doing that is Gunmo. Gun. <laughs> you know that? No. It's Devi. How? <coughs> I have to take some 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 natural natural gear. Give me my natural gear, my friend. <coughs> Wait for Devi Junior. <laughs> Guys, it's called a natural hub. Herbicide? Uh, herbicide again. Tog. <laughs> to, 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 <laughs> to, to. Is it uh, that one? This is Natural herb. Natural, natural herb. 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 That is yeah, natural herb. porridge. No, no. Not natural porridge. Uh, this dog. dog. How crazy is that? Can you imagine? So, guys, let's come back to Pablo K.E. because this is what he said. He finally responded to Mura Senso. Finally. And I stand people who say no to disrespect. I'll, <laughs> personally, I'll not do that. I'd rather. <laughs> Let me not even say, but I'll not lay low for someone to walk all over me because of what views. I understand, yes, because of the views, the subscribers, you get what you want to get, but hell no. Nah. Hmm. No. So, he finally came, came out to condemn Mura Senso, and this is what he said, F you, for whatever, for the, for the fans to school my kid. To school one of our family because uh, it comes with disrespect and i like of course it's always is it sensible or uh, mature or something mature or sensible this is yet some uh, advices to mura and i loved it i loved it i've never seen someone uh, come up with uh, such a um, sensible words let me use that term because this is what he said number one mura senso is the the chief spreader of all these hate divisions because he's up there telling his people oh guys these people are coming for me they want to destroy us well that is what he does every sunday that is what he does that is something that i liked about uh, about pablo that analysis that uh, finding was 100 percent correct that is what mura does that is what mura does dividing the villagers insulting every single thing Mura is the chief, the king of all those things. The king of all those things, but he'll come out here, oh my Donatos, these people want to destroy us. Well, that is what he's doing. Number two, this is what he said, of course, stop. You can keep your money. You don't have to to pay the school fees for my family because uh, you came out here, called me out, you know, insulted me, your people were coming for my kids, this and that, and I was like, yeah, you're so right, and Mura should do stay with the school fees because after all this is what pablo said after all after all the school fees that you paid for my for my nephew is it nephew or niece hey <laughs> for my nephew was um was from your donators it was not your cash which is thank you for mentioning that because uh that is one habit that is one habit that Amura uh, has. He comes out here, collects the money from, from his subscribers and he'll come out here pretending like he's the one paying. While all he does is get these funds from all these people, take a percentage and give the rest to the people who are truthfully supposed to be given the entire amount. Saying family, family, narrowing down. There's a family that talks bad things about me. People, do you think that I can continue helping their child? Or don't, man, don't, don't, bro. Allah, don't. But when one forces anyone to help, no. And let me give you one good advice, brother. When you help, don't come out with telling people help you. Don't be like a politician. You know, politicians hold people are troublesome. Like if you don't vote for me, I won't do this for you. If you don't vote for me, I won't push for you to get better roads. If you don't vote for me. I won't push for you to get water. If you don't vote for me, you won't get electricity. And that's what happens in Africa. Mostly in our country here. So don't be like that. If you help and someone turns against you, let God deal with that person. You know, you can't on camera now saying, oh, I did this people are great for what? Let your deeds show. Because I'm telling like a brother and as a friend. No one will ever tell you. Because most people fear you. They fear you. 
when they're close to you they fear telling you the truth but they lie to you you tend to listen to more lies than the truth i couldn't believe what you said on camera calling us poor but i'm not poor man i'm not poor Maro. i'm not poor i'm not poor one day one day you truly know if i'm poor you truly know if i'm poor i've taken so much time to sit down and like think about the events I think, today's on, uh, I think today's on Wednesday, since Sunday, when you did that live. Because you do do things with um, emotions. Don't let emotion drive you. Don't let emotions drive you. You Don't. Before you go, or oh, switch on the camera. Think, do positive things, not things that bring divisions, man. You're the one who champion like so much divisions. You should solve that, but you're the one who's championing it. You're championing for the division of the village. You're the one pushing for that. Looking at the big brother up there, you know the one bringing that. Cause I couldn't see even uh, what you said in that library could condemn. My children been attacked, but you still push that agenda like yo. If you really wanted to talk direct to me, man, put that camera down. Come talk to me. Come talk to me. Put your camera down. Come talk to me. Man. Come talk to me. And tell me what the issues are you having with me. Put that camera down. Come talk to me. The pressure is getting rather than going around in circles. It's too low of you. I'm so ashamed of you, man. I'm so ashamed of you. I'm so ashamed of you. I couldn't believe this. Because nowhere, nowhere I've ever talked bad about you. But if you see something wrong, I'll come and say it. Just a simple thing. Put that camera down. Come and face me. So, that is all what uh, Pablo said. Of course, a lot of things, but of course, I'll just summarize. Or rather, I'll just mention most of the things that I'd like to mention from that video. So, that is it. Mura has been told to F off. <laughs> you can stop paying the school fees. We don't need nothing from you because this is what uh, Mura said. Pablo's family are poor. And of course, Pablo came out here to make a point that we are not that poor and of course i don't get anyone anyone that will come out here and be like oh africans are poor or call out one of the families single out one family that you're poor i've seen the pablo's family they seem to have a huge piece of land and of course a lot of people don't understand the, the value of things like property because i'm sure if they decide to sell the entire property of course that is something that they not or rather not wish them to do they could be richer than Mura because for someone, of, of course I don't know for a fact if they have uh, that huge piece of land but I'm talking about any family that has more than 20 acres. Those are millionaires but uh, it's something within us. We never sell land. In fact, we go acquiring but not at the rate at which Mura is doing because Mura is not even doing in a rightful way. Of course, we've had a lot of stories about them. They acquire these things through a dubious way dubious ways they'll lend you something take your land this and that but this is what i have to say it's so ridiculous for mura to call them poor well there are people who own land if these people would decide that they don't want to sell the property most of the properties they could be richer than him just the way the lamborghini mwango came out here and be like oh guys you know african tigress she's not like me but when you go to these websites uh, social blade. African Tigress is earning more than Limwango. These people are just ignorant, arrogant and foolish. That is what I have to say because I even get tired watching them nowadays because a bunch of clowns. So I stand anyone that says no to disrespect. I applaud Pablo because he has finally, finally come out to put respect on his name and I hope Mura Senso takes some advice from him because he mentioned a lot of things you know Mura Senso will have friendship with the, the Mole the insulters of the village the likes of Gitiriba, <laughs> Mayugno 
this is what Pablo said. He is surrounded by the likes of Mayumno, Gitriba, these weirdos. And Mura Senso, because of his foolishness, this is what he does. Listens to what these two tell him, these people tell him, and takes it for that without doing further investigation to know whether what they are telling him is true or not. They, he doesn't. And he comes out here embarrassing himself every single day. That is what he does. Can you imagine? Can you imagine you have uh, that amount of subscribers, that amount of views, that amount of uh, dollar? But you'll still come out here on a Sunday insulting people? Because that is what Mura does. Comes out here on Sunday and that is what he does. And <laughs> it's ridiculous only. It's someone with no. And that is what I have to say, honestly. So, guys, that was it for today. A very short one. I hope you enjoyed, you were entertained. You shared your thoughts in the comment section. Let me know you could be disagreeing with every single thing that I said. Just feel free in the comment section to let us know. And of course, we'll be there to interact with you. So, thank you so much for watching. I really, really appreciate your presence, your time. Thank you so much. So, once again, if you've not subscribed, kindly consider subscribing, share your thoughts in the comment section, like the video, turn the notification bell on, so that you can be notified whenever I upload, I go on a pre I premiere a video, I go on a live, kindly do so if you can. But of course, if you just watched, and that is it, just know that I really, really appreciate you. I'm so grateful. Thank you so much. So, of course, for my people, thank you so much for always coming back. You watch, you like, you share, you comment. Thank you so much because without you there is no channel so that was it for today that was it for this video until the next one peace